Hey guys, so I just made me a new waist bead. It's so cute. Look at it. It has these gold drop shells on it. So it's going to kind of have a little dangly effect when I'm wearing it. It's on stretch cord. So here is the slip knot. I'm going to pull the slip knot. And I'm going to be gentle, but still I'm going to pull the um, strong enough for me to pull it. Then I'm going to wrap it around my waist, try to gauge because it's a 50 plus inch waist bead. So I'm going to have to adjust it. So I'm going to kind of see, you know, and look at how much beads or how many beads I'm going to have to drop. And um, I'm, before I drop the beads, I want to secure a knot on the end so the beads won't fall as I'm adjust. You can also use a bead clamp if you have one. Most people won't have one. So that's a little trick that I do. I just tie a little knot to catch the beads, then I'll adjust and um, get it to the size that I want. And then once I figure out the size that I want, I'm gonna, um, you know, just kind of check, make sure everything is good and at the exact correct size before I tie the knot. Then once everything is where I need it to be, I'm going to go ahead and start tying the knot. I'm going to cross over and then I'm going to cross over and then I'm going to go under one time, go under two times, maybe three times if I need to. And then after that, I'm going to pull. Then I'm going to cross over again. And then I'm going to wrap it around once and then probably twice for a secure knot. And then I'm going to pull it tight. And then after that, I should have a really good secure knot. And sometimes beads get in the way. You got you to gotta move some beads out the way before you pull it tight. So just make sure everything is exactly how you want it before you pull it tight. It's the size you want and everything so it looks like it's where it needs to be so I'm gonna pull it tight and you can wrap it around a few times more if you want it the more you wrap it around I understand that that's um, the more secure it is when you're tying the knot so now that it's tied I do it again wrap it around I do like I'll uh, do like three or four knots so I'm gonna tie it pull then I'm gonna cross over again go under or go under go under then pull tight and once I do about three or four knots and I feel that it's secure I'm good so I'm checking it out and making sure it's where I want it to be and it's fitting the way I need it to be and then after that I'm gonna get the scissors and I'm gonna cut the extra string that I have right there and sometimes the extra string is enough for you to tie, make a bracelet or tie a bracelet or ankle it and you can do that and there's my waist bead, guys. A little close-up action. 